And hello to you, just sitting up there by yourself like one of the old guys from the Muppets. <laughs> Very weird. Um, hey, I'm uh, from a small country town called Hayfield. And uh, for those of you who don't know, Hayfield is an Aboriginal word, which means place of limited job opportunity. <laughs> and I grew up on a farm there, and the worst thing about growing up on a farm was Christmases and birthdays. Because every Christmas and birthday, without fail, on the farm, instead of real presents, my parents would buy me pets for Christmas. Now, there's probably city kids here going, hey, pets for Christmas, excellent present. But if you grow up on a farm, pets are the worst present you can get. So me and my brother, what we used to do to piss our parents off is we would name our pets after what we'd really wanted for Christmas. <laughs> so we had a dog called Nintendo, <laughs> a cat called Barbie Dreamhouse, <laughs> a couple of goldfish called Decent Bloody Parents. <laughs> it's very weird. I went to uh, England recently and I loved it over there, but it was, I thought the weird subtle differences in the language were weird. I was there the first night and I'm a single person. The first night I was like dancing with some girls and stuff. I've gone down, met up with some of my English friends the next day and they said, oh, did you have a good time last night? I said, did I dance with some girls? It was pretty cool. They said, oh, did you pull? <laughs> they said, did you pull? And what they meant was, did you pick up? Did you go home with somebody? That's what they call it over there. They go, hey, did you pull? And I was just staring at them going, that's not what that means in my country. <laughs> in my country, that's what you do when you don't pick up. <laughs> so yeah, I pulled. But, <laughs> The whole Millennium uh, Babies thing was weird too. Did anyone have a go at having the first baby of the new Millennium? That was weird, like, because nobody knew when to do it. It was somewhere between March 20 and April 17. And that, because that's quite a big period of time, isn't it? Obviously, you've got to be, you know, ovulating at the right time. Then there's 38 to 41 weeks of the gestation period. Then, of course, only 5% of babies are actually born on the 8th of June. Then, of course, you've got to make a laugh. <laughs> or is that sentence sounded to any man in this room? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> blah, 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 blah